The Maginot Line takes its name from André Maginot, the French politician and Minister of War who advocated for the construction of the fortifications. It's a huge bunker-like military zone that France built in the 1930s to prepare for a German attack. In fact, starting about 10 kilometers from the German-French border, tanks and barbed wire, 17 large forts of 500 to 1,000 men, 352 bunkers of 20 to 30 men, 78 shelters, 17 reinforced concrete bunkers for observation, and about 5,000 ground launchers were built in fortified zones of up to 20 kilometers in circumference along the 750 kilometer Franco-German border from Switzerland to Luxembourg. The fortress's defenses were so formidable, the thinnest concrete bastion was 3.5 meters thick that no army at the time was able to break through them head on. Ironically, Germany bypassed the Maginot Line to enter Belgium and occupy France. 